Hello and welcome back to the Beer Dog Reviews. As always, I'm Chris and continuing the uh, German beer set that I've got, we have Meisel's Weiss. It's a traditional Weiss beer by the looks of things. This one comes in at, if I can find it, 5.1%. It's a 500ml bottle and uh, da, da, da. as you can see, as you expect from a traditional German Weiss beer, water, wheat malt, barley malt, yeast and hops. Nothing else. Just what you expect. Yeah. Fairly simple label there. There's the crown, again echoing the simpleness of the, or simpleness, the simplicity of the label. So, let's get it out and have a look. Bit of smoke on the opening, not a massive amount but yeah, just a tad. I do like a nice vice beer, so let's have a look at this one. Let that head develop. And there we go. So you've got standard uh, one and a half on this one, finger of creamy, fluffy white head. Nice, rich, straw coloured beer. Hazy as you like, you can't see anything through that, can you? Slightly hissing head, not a massive amount there. So I would say it's, can't see the bubbles, but I would say it's not quite as carbonated as some of the others I've had. A bit lighter than some, a bit darker than others. Let's have a look. Getting the standard banana and clovey spicy fruity aroma coming out. It's that wheatiness. Not getting an awful lot of the malt so yeah seems like a standard recipe for a, a Weizen. Let's have a look at the taste. Ooh, you can feel the carbonation on this one, which you don't awfully get with a lot of other ones. But this one, you can really feel that carbonation just hitting the tongue. A bit of noise outside. I don't, if you can hear that on my camera, I do apologise. Banana. Not getting an awful lot of spice coming from that one. It's nice. It's not the best vice beer I've ever had. It's perfectly acceptable. Tyrion's joining in with the noise coming from outside. I think there's some workmen down the road. He doesn't like people encroaching upon his territory. Okay, back to the beer. The main thing I'm getting is the banana hit to begin with. You can feel the fizz of the carbonation as it runs across your palate. Bit of a wheat and that's about it. It's not a bad beer. Perfectly drinkable. It's a quite a sessionable wheat beer. But it's not going to join the ranks of my top ranks of the Weinstefana, the uh, Schneiderweiss. It's 
perfectly nice. I can enjoy it. Would I recommend it? Yeah, I think I would. But only if you can't get Schneiderweiss, Vine Stefana, or possibly Franciscana. I'd put it on the level of Erdinger for me. Erdinger's not my favourite vice beer. It's a very nice beer, don't get me wrong, but this one, the uh, Meisel's vice. I'll sit down there with Erdinger for me. In terms of nice beer, but I'll look for something else first. Well, it is a very good beer. I have yet to find a vice beer that I don't like. So, cheers to you all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down there. As always, I'll pop the links for my Twitter, my Instagram, and Facebook down in the description box below. And I'll see you all again next time. Happy drinking.